Welcome to the chapter Visualizing solid shapes is a useful skill. You should be able to see the hidden parts of the solid shape. Two different ways of viewing different sections of solid are by cutting or slicing the shape by shadow play. Click each tab to know more. Visualizing solid shapes by cutting or slicing the shape and the circle shown on screen. But again, when we cut the cucumber vertically, the shape differs. The cross section of various solid shapes depends on the type of cut made. Visualizing solid shapes by shadow play. We already know that the shadows of 3D objects are two-dimensional. Now, observe the shadow of the image shown on screen. Is there any depth contained in it? No, it doesn't. So, the shadows of three-dimensional objects are two-dimensional. For example, the shadow of a 3D cuboid is two-dimensional. The type of arrangement used to see the shadow method is as shown on screen. The arrangement consists of a blank screen, solid of any shape and torch. Keep a torch light right in front of cone and switch on the torch. Now, observe the shadow on the blank screen. Here the solid is a three-dimensional figure but its shadow is two-dimensional. Now, if we change the position of the solid objects, we observe many different ways of shadows. Similarly, if we change the position of the light source, again we observe changes in the shadow. And one of the most common example is that of an object whose shadow is cast by the sun. Sun is the light source for the objects. So we can see what happens if the sun is changing its position throughout the day? For example, observe the shadow of the tree during morning, afternoon and evening. Thus, the shadow of any object is related to the position of the sun and the time of observation. 